They look the same. Are they different? Hi and welcome. If you're new here, welcome. I hope we can earn your subscription. I'm going to take a quick look at the start and bean gaps and show you what the difference is. So give this a look. I will open the bean gap and then move it to the right hand screen and then open the start app. You can see they have both been set to use the same background. As you can see, they both have the same account and weather widget. They both have the same search, the exact same apps in the apps row, the same home feed area, the same menu. The two apps themselves are identical to each other in both function and UI. The UX is the same as well. The differences are not in the application itself, but instead in the number of widgets available. I have closed both of the applications so that I can get back to the home screen. I am going to touch and hold the home screen until the option appears to allow me to make modifications to my screens. I'm going to do the same thing that you would do if you were adding a widget. We will select the widgets option down at the bottom. And once the widgets are open, we will scroll down to the Bing widget. Bing has a total of nine widgets and Start has a total of seven. Seven of the nine Bing widgets are the same as the Start app widgets. I will show you the difference, the two widgets that the Start app does not have. Scroll over to the two widgets that are different, the two reward widgets. Sorry for being so slow. And there they are. The reward widget style one and style two. That's the only difference in the two applications, these two widgets. These widgets would be added to your M365 feed or to any of your screens. Should you uninstall the Bing app, you would lose these two widgets. But that's all you would lose. Not much difference, is there? Just the two widgets, that's it. Don't need them? Yeah, you can ditch the Bing app. The two apps are meant to come together to be the same as is the experience that you get using Microsoft Edge to browse either Bing.com or Start.com, though I've had some issues getting to Start.com lately. If you found this helpful, please give it a like. Likes are good for the algorithm, as I've said before. Share it, let other people know, comment, tell me what you think. What would you like to hear more about? Subscribe, those help too. And last, but still the most important, thanks for watching.